Hi there, my name is Jared. I'm one of the lead clinicians at the Physio Clinic in Barefoot in Harborn. And we're here on the 1st of October and we're now uh, fully open, fully staffed, almost fully booked, really busy. And it gives me great pleasure to spend some time with Sundeep, Lisa, Alina and Emma. And in the clinic, we see lots and lots of female pelvic health. We see lots of patients uh, who are going through pregnancy. We see lots of mums, both new mums, mums with older toddlers and children. We see lots of complex pelvic pain. We see lots of endometriosis, lots of postnatal rectus diastasis, lots of people who want to get, get back uh, into sport and exercise postnatally, people who are worried about their tummy, uh, people who want to come for a mummy MOT to make sure that everything's okay. Uh, we also see lots of women with urinary symptoms, lots of prolapse, and lots of women also who've got pelvic health problems completely unrelated to pregnancy, because uh, people can have a pelvic health problem and, and not have been through pregnancy. And then we also do lots of male pelvic health, particularly myself and Lisa. So we see lots of tons of male pelvic pain from all over, all over the place. We see lots of... Um, sporting pelvic pain, we see lots of patients with hard flaccid, and we see lots of men who've gone through that kind of real trauma prostate surgery where they get urinary incontinence, erectile dysfunction post-surgery. Um, and I wanted just to let you know what everyone does. So I will hand over to Lisa. Hello, I'm Lisa. I'm another specialist pelvic health physiotherapist. Um, I see lots of different patients at um, the Barefoot Harbour Clinic, including men, women, children, all with pelvic health problems from urinary incontinence, overactive bladders, um, erectile dysfunction, pelvic pain, um, childhood issues with incontinence and um, bedwetting, problems gaining continence. Um, we also see women um, during the perimenopause and menopausal phases with lots of bowel and bladder issues. See quite a number of bowel patients as well. And yeah, plenty of pelvic pain. So lots of variety. Um, and we've got lots of experience in the area. So um, we've been working in this field for 10, 15 years now. So, uh, uh, Only joke, Lisa. <laughs> no, not quite. <laughs> it feels like it though. Um, and so, yeah, it's grown and grown. And there are more people out there who are realising that there are certainly treatments that are very effective for these issues and not suffering in silence or perhaps putting up with their symptoms as they once were which is great um, um i'm also quite an active member of various you know um social media facebook groups including the vaginal atrophy group and um with jane lewis and yeah enjoy a lot of teaching as well to share those skills Brilliant. Thank you, Lisa. And Lisa is truly gifted at this. And then let's go to Sundeep, who's just below. So, Sundeep. Hello, my name's Sundeep. I'm another uh, pelvic health specialist based at Harborn Physiotherapy Clinic. Um, I am happy to see women with all sorts of aspects of pelvic health symptoms. So, I, I would see people antenatally for pelvic girdle pain i could see you postnatally you know in terms of recovery related to your uh, diastasis um, and post-birth trauma any sorts of symptoms related to bladder or bowel um, i see women at all sorts of stages so as lisa mentioned uh, perimenopause and menopause is another stage where uh, you can have urinary and bladder um, and bowel symptoms that uh, physiotherapy can help with and my other specialist area is pelvic pain and in particular endometriosis 
And so I see a lot of ladies who have uh, got recent and even longer diagnosis with endometriosis um, to help them as part of their management, uh, either pre uh, laparoscopy and post laparoscopy surgery um, and helping with overactive pelvic floor. Um, and similar to Lisa, I also teach um, to help share skills and I'm happy to talk to anyone about how physiotherapy can help them. Brilliant. And Sundeep and I also work in Coventry University together. So we share an office or we shared an office before COVID. We did. And then let's go to Alina. Hi. Hi, my name is Alina. Um, I also work with, uh, with Jared and Lisa and Sandeep and Emma in Harborn Physiotherapy. Um, and I'm happy to see um, all women. So with um, both antenatal, postnatal, antenatal pain, uh, pelvic girdle pain, um, or, um, SPD, um, any women after delivery so i specialize with oasis and i also work in the women's hospital so i can also make connection and refer uh to that oasis um, um scans if needed and um and i see all women in all stages like some deep so with prolapse or going through menopause and supporting women through that transition uh in life which is a very important and not spoken enough transition um to kind of bring to awareness understanding and treating all the symptoms that come with it and uh women with prolapse and pain um so i see all range of women i also see um pediatrics so kids that um finding it difficult to gain continence or have uh, sudden incontinence uh, showing up again or any bowel issues. I, um, I love tre treating bowels. It's, a, it's one of my passions and I interests. Uh, so I really enjoy seeing patients and talking about what's not talked about, which is our poop, which is very interesting. Um, and um, um, yeah, so, and I enjoy also teaching with Jared, and well, I helped with some courses, which was really great. Um, so I think it's it's so important to spread our knowledge. Um, it's just great to be part of it. Brilliant. Thank you very, very much. And it's amazing to have Alina working with us. And then, so we lost Kath, because Kath, we loved Kath. Kath was another of our postnatal pregnancy pelvic health physios and Kath saw both men and women in barefoot but Kath moved back to the Czech Republic but she left us a gift she left us Emma so Emma's quite new so what I'm putting you on the spot Emma tell us the brilliance that you do completely putting me on the spot so my name's Emma nice to meet you I'm uh, one of the pelvic health physiotherapists working in the specialist clinic with Gerard Lisa Sandy and Alina um, so it's nice to join everybody to work together to um, try and help in particular my specialities is um, to work with ladies um, during pregnancy um, and postnatally as well to help returning to their activities and normal um, function including returning to sports um, doing a variety of um, treating a variety of ladies um, with urinary symptoms, um, prolapse symptoms, um, postnatal tears, and completing um, mummy MOTs, which is including diastasis um, care. So again, rehabbing the rectus abdominals um, to return back to normal um, function and to help us get back into activities. Brilliant, thank you. Now, and before before I finish this, I'd like to say that I speak to a lot of the patients before they book in, whether that's some of the parents with some of the toddlers with constipation, some of the toddlers with bedwetting, whether it's some of the women with quite awful pelvic pain or prolapse, or some of the moms who've really lost confidence because they've got bowel problems, or whether it's some of the men with pelvic pain. So I kind of maybe speak to them at the start when things are awful and then you see these people at the end and the, and the work that both Lisa, Sundeep, Alina, Emma, uh, I'll probably add myself in there as well, uh, the, the work that's done in the clinic really has a massive impact on on these patients and also on their their kind of family partner 
and that family so i feel privileged to have all these guys as friends and colleagues and uh if you want to see any of them you know check us out on the website and uh they will make them we will all make a, a massive impact and help you where we can thank you very much